Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Zero, and welcome to Broken Veil, an upcoming horror game where a Russian child must find his mother. So we've spawned an orphanage. Uh, there's something outside of the window. Uh, do, do any of you ever kids see this? It's a weird scary thing out the window. It's pretty creepy looking. Well, it's gone. What's going on out here? It's an old lady. I'm not here if that's what you were curious about. Gotta get out of here before she turns on the TV. So I guess we're just sneaking out of this orphanage. Don't know if there's anything in there. See creepy dolls. Left mouse to push. So, obviously a little nightmares feel. Not sure what the doll head's for. Oh god! Person! Don't put me in the closet! See, the real, uh, the real horror is just being in an orphanage. So let's move a little bit faster this time. Now, I'm assuming you're going to come out and check the thing. I'm trying to think we can lock you in there. No, we can't. Just keep going. Push. There we go. Isn't that a, uh... No, I'm thinking of something else. I thought it was like a mascot or something. Oh man, sand pit. Nice. I'm satisfied. Left mouse the whole time, space to throw them. So we've taken this truck somewhere. I guess we really want to find our mom. Oh look, kids. Wait, no, they're not kids. Those are... Oh, God. Oh, oh, they have no faces. They have faces suddenly. This is what happens when you do nothing but squatting around drinking. This is what you become. I'm assuming this is going to be a symbolic game. Like, things are going to look monstrous or twisted because that's... How you view that adult. Cat, meow. A 
Laser? Oh my god. I can play, like, with a cat with a laser. You can guide the cat with a laser pointer to reach high spots. Go get a key. Thanks. What was that for? Well, I'm expecting to get in this gap. Okay, we're good. Now oh, we're at a butcher. Of course. Can't push that open. Fro. Nice. Um. Oh, you know what? I know what, what what happened. Down you go. I think you're too heavy. Now throw. There we go. We're gonna jump on you, and then we're gonna hitch a ride. A one that's empty, just has some like string or something. Hanging. Huh. Huh. Not tall enough. Or long enough. Need to jump from up here. Or maybe from the shelf. I'm not sure yet. No, it's from this one. Hopefully I am not about to go into some kind of weird meat processor. I'm about to go into the meat processor. Oh god! Okay, so let's just... Yeah, let's just drop. Good meat. Uh, I see a vent over there. Maybe we gotta go in that. So I'm assuming we're not opening that. I got a bone to pick up you, Vent. Quite literally. I'm gonna literally pick you open with a bone. Yeah, it worked. Oh god. Yeah, see. It went from like a faceless adult butcher. Oh god. No, oh, no, no, oh no. Okay, okay, okay. Please, sir, leave me alone. I'm a small child, and you are a big man with a big butcher. Well, hook thing. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, yeah, we're dead. Yeah, we didn't need much swing on that. I overdid it. 
Not the fish. Not the milk bottles. Nope. I think we... We unintentionally glitched out and grabbed the thing. As you know, I understood it now. I went, went look back at my recording. I thought we glitched out, but it hit the... It hit the thing and it launched us up. It just looked a little funny because I was like applying forward momentum at the same time. So that's it for the Broken Veil vale demo. So right now what this one has going for is aesthetic, the, the monster design and everything. Um, the way the adults kind of become twisted and stuff. Like I said, it's probably symbolic. It's probably not literally monsters. But the child views them as so. So they... First they start off faceless because the child doesn't care about them. You know, they just see them as never like bad adult. So they're all faceless. Then they become like actual monsters and get progressively more twisted as they uh, can evolve. So I dig the Russian aesthetic. I like the horror vibe. Uh, it is very close to Little Nightmares. Um, Limbo and some of those other things like that. So how you stand out in that kind of realm is it's definitely going to come down to polish. Uh, level design, kind of pacing, stuff like that. Because the core of the, the inside... Limbo, Little Nightmares, uh, going back forever, like Hard Darkness, kind of thing like that. Is you have some basic puzzles, you have a lot of running, and a lot of things that will like instantly kill you. It is a game genre that has essentially existed since the, uh, it's like the, almost like the Sega Genesis early PC era. Starting with uh, Out of This World, I think is one of the first ones, Prince of Persia and Out of This World. So it's, it's definitely just going to come down to like, is it paced well? That's what makes you uh, a good game of this genre. Anyway. So, thank you all for watching me play the Broken Veil demo. I'll see you guys later, and take it easy.